Believe, dream, inspire. Now a lot of people have many interpretations for it. I've even heard some crazy ones like I believe my house is haunted. But that's not my interpretation. My interpretation has to do with careers, like singing, dancing, etc. For me, it's filmmaking. Back in the day of 2005, I watched a movie trilogy called Star Wars. It was an incredible experience for me. I remember watching Yoda act all crazy, Han Solo be awesome, and I even remember my reaction to the truth about Darth Vader. No. I Ah, <laughs> <sighs> good times. But then I saw the prequels. Seeing Star Wars made me have appreciation for other films like Jurassic Park, Mission Impossible. <laughs> Citizens of Gotham City, you've got it all here today to listen to what I have to say. Gotham is in ashes, and the only way to stop it is to neutralize. Oh, wait, I don't even understand a word you're saying. You've got this thing all over your face. Maybe you should just take it off and speak clearly. Maybe we'll understand what you want. And it was around 2008 when something very incredible happened. And it went kind of like this. <sighs> it was a great movie. Let me see if SpongeBob's on. There's, there's, there's the remote. Where's the remote? 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 from me. What are all these names? It was from that moment on when I learned about credits. The list of people that worked on the movie. And that's when I realized I want to do that. I want to have people working for me help me make a movie. I want to do that. And it was from that moment on I wanted to become a filmmaker. I watched multiple films that helped me shape the ideas in my head. And all of that happened because one day I watched Star Wars. And remember, if you get inspired by someone to get a career that you really want, do it. Don't stop, just keep on going. If you believe you can do it and dream you can do it, you might be able to inspire others as well. <laughs>